Hello and welcome. Today I want to talk about the support doc. Here I have the table with the cooldown times, the token cost and the cripple amount because the doc cripples the nearest uh, walker or enemy. So also for human enemies the human will cripple. And you see a cripple duration time. So with level 5 you could cripple two rounds. And you could cripple two enemies in level 2. And three enemies in level 4. So this is the dog. And you always cripple the nearest enemies, the survivor who has the dog. So not of all survivors were, or the leader, just the user of the dog. And he cripples the nearest walkers or human enemies. So in... Freeman missions you will also cripple the humans and you will stop the overwatch in this case. So for example if you see the human enemy and you don't want to trigger the overwatch attack you can cripple the enemy and so he will not do his overwatch attack and you could hit them without getting hit in this case so it's also good for enemy missions in guild war and yes now i want to show you how you could use the dog so you click on the dog and you see a frame around the walker and if you click away you could uh, move to survivor and this is an example how you could switch between the enemies so beta is moving down and now use the dog and the other survivor uh, other walker is targeting so if you click a second time on the dog the nearest enemy is crippled so here's a